welcome back to Willow's Notes. Today's video is question of the day. It's a multiple choice question about hydrogen bonds. Let's read the question together. The figure below shows the hydrogen bond formed between methanol and water. Which statement best explains the formation of this bond? I want you now to pause the video and try to answer the question. My advice is before even reading the choices, look at what you have. You have hydrogen bond, there's water, methanol. So we're asked to see which statement best explains why this bond was even formed. We know that a hydrogen bond always forms between a delta negative and a delta positive atom. So let's look at which choice best explains that. Let's read choice A. Both the oxygen in methanol and in water have a partial positive charge. So it's saying that both of these are delta positive. We know that's not correct. So choice A cannot be the right answer. Now let's look at choice B. The oxygen in methanol has a partial positive charge. So it says that this has a partial positive charge and the hydrogen in water has a partial negative charge. Again, the hydrogen is not partially negative, so B cannot be the right choice. Moving along to choice C. Methanol is nonpolar and water is polar. If methanol is nonpolar, then how come there's a hydrogen bond between them? So obviously that's not the answer. And of course, you're not expected to know every single molecule whether or not they're polar. But obviously, this is not the choice because we already have a hydrogen bond and we're asked why did the hydrogen bond form? That leaves us with the last choice, D. The oxygen in methanol, so the oxygen in methanol, has a partial negative charge and the hydrogen in water has a partial positive charge. Does this explain why the hydrogen bond is forming? Of course, because delta negative delta positive attract and a hydrogen bond forms. So the choice here is D. This was an easy AP question. I really hope you got it right. If you have any questions, don't hesitate to write them in the comments down below and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.